This season has been nothing but success so far for the Green Bay Packers. Isaiah has been a huge addition for the Packers offense. Last week he had two rushing touchdowns, over 100 yards rushing on the ground as well. Isaiah has been stellar. He's got special handshakes for the defense. He's telling Clay Matthews, if you guys take care of business today, if you shut down Joe Flacco and Mike Wallace and Justin Forsett, then Isaiah says he'll take care of business and do his part on offense. And the first time Isaiah's going to touch the ball here is early in the first quarter. It's going to be a huge pump because our defense stepped up and made some big plays. Well, Isaiah feels it back in the five. He's going to move his way out to the right-hand side. He's got some good blocks so far. A couple guys in front of him. Can he make a miss? The first juke is money, but the second one doesn't really go anywhere. But he gets the ball down all the way to the 47-yard line. Now, after a penalty, it's second to 15. Ryder throws the ball out to Isaiah. Isaiah on the edge jumps in the air for no reason. Really, Isaiah, you've got to stop the jumps. They're not working like you think they are. Now, 39, Isaiah moves his way across the middle of the field. A great reception here. Finds a way to get down inside the 30. And on second and 12, Isaiah with the carry up the middle. Makes a couple defenders miss. The speed juke is money. Isaiah is now into the red zone. What a play by your boy Isaiah King. Now, Riders dumps one down this time to Devontae Adams. Devontae Adams finds his way down to the 5. And when you're this close to the goal line, of course you want to give the ball to Isaiah King. The league leading rusher in both rushing yards and rushing touchdowns. And in my opinion, the best dance moves in the entire NFL. Now Rodgers is going to find a little ball here to Devontae Adams. Devontae Adams on the right-hand sideline. He's throwing defenders to the ground, and Devontae Adams gets in. Look at Isaiah. Isaiah's even pumped up. Isaiah did nothing on that play. Devontae Adams did all the work, makes a defender miss, throws two guys to the ground, a third defender to the ground, and he gets in on a huge play, even with those pink cleats. Kind of incredible. Now first and 10 here in the second quarter. Isaiah right down the middle, and look at this. Isaiah tries to hurdle Eric Weddle, and he slams into the ground. Things got a little dicey there. Eric Weddle, I thought, was going to powerbomb Isaiah, but he finds his way out of that one safely. Now Isaiah here to the edge, makes the juke move in. Oh, Eric Weddle, pick up your shoestrings, pick up your jock strap. It's all on the ground. Isaiah with the huge move and a big touchdown to give the Green Bay Packers an even larger lead. Over 500 yards rushing so far. We're going at halftime with a 21-14 lead. Isaiah has been killing the Ravens defense. Let's hope he can keep it up in the second half. A good play action here by Aaron Rodgers. Those are the cross middle. This time, Randall Cobb makes a defender miss and gets across the 50 for our offense. And on second and four, Isaiah's going to stay in for blocking. Randall Rodgers throws it out to the right-hand side again. This time, we're going to get a few yards here by Richard Rodgers as he gets down to the 29-yard line. On first and ten, Isaiah gets a carry here to the left-hand side. He's going to try and hurdle the defender. He hurdles Eric Weddle. Eric Weddle, Isaiah has your number today. But number 39 comes in with the big hit, and Isaiah gets destroyed, but he hops up quickly. Those young legs are easy to recover now. And with 32, Isaiah rolls to the right-hand side, doesn't get the ball, but instead, Aaron Rodgers goes to the left-hand side. Isaiah's still hyped, because look at this offense. It's kind of unstoppable, if you ask me. Randall Cobb with a great reception here. Eric Weddle, this is not your day, man. You need to retire, because the way you're looking so far, you played a season too long. Now, here in the fourth quarter, going to the halfback screen, look at Isaiah. Finding his way through, a great block there. Isaiah's got a couple guys to miss, but he can't get past them. He stopped at the 50-yard line by a couple of defenders. Aaron Rodgers is now over 200 yards passing. Isaiah comes out on this play, and a great little dime here by Aaron Rodgers to Randall Cobb. Now, on the 23-yard line, Isaiah's back in the ballgame. Get the inside zone run. Isaiah's going to try to push his way forward first down, but he shot just short of the marker. Now, first to go on the eight, Cobb is in motion. Rodgers is back, pressures in the face. He throws it off to Isaiah. Isaiah's got some room here. Can he get into the end zone? He's going to be stopped, though. Eric Weddle with a big hit on the two-yard line. Isaiah's going to stay in for blocking. And look at your boy, Aaron Rodgers. Another passing touchdown. This has been incredible because last season when Isaiah played for the Patriots, Tom Brady really wasn't doing this. I told you guys at the beginning of the season, Aaron Rodgers is a bad man. He might be the best quarterback in the league, in my opinion. And he shows it there with a big touchdown pass to Randall Cobb. So Harbaugh, I'm sorry about your luck, man. You're not going to walk out of here with a W today. We get a big victory against the Ravens. 35-17. Joe Flacco got exposed this afternoon. Aaron Rodgers with a 138 QB rating. Over 250 passing yards. Three touchdowns. Justin Forsett had a solid game, but Isaiah with 115 on the ground. Two touchdowns on the ground as well. Nearly identical numbers to what he had last week, which is pretty incredible. And moving on to the next game, it's against the Atlanta Falcons in their brand new stadium. Isaiah's hyped, but look at Devonta Freeman getting a lot of play time today. He's trying to show the TV cameras that he's ready to put on the show, but hopefully our defense steps up. Isaiah's showing off the moves, pitches this at the backup halfback. He's going to make a few moves, but you know what? They're not nearly as good as your boy Isaiah King. Now Rodgers in the pocket here, Isaiah with a crucial block, and Montgomery's going to haul in one, falls to the ground immediately. On first and 10, we're down 7-0 still. Rodgers throws a dart out here to the left-hand side, and Randall Cobb hauls in another one. He's been coming along pretty well this part of the season. Hopefully he can keep it up, but on the halfback screen on third and six, things aren't going to go our way, and the Atlanta Falcons defense shuts us down. 
And moving on the second quarter, Riders back in shotgun, throws it across middle to Isaiah, but we get lit up by number 55, and we drop that one. Isaiah typically has really good hands, but that one didn't work out. And Isaiah to the edge, he tries to hurdle again. He goes up to the top shelf and gets dropped just short of the marker. So third and one, Isaiah with the ball. He's going to try and hurl a defender, and it works this time. He's got one guy to beat. He tries to stiff arm him, but they bring him down at the 25. Isaiah, these hurdles are getting out of control, man. I don't know what to tell you. I know they're your favorite move, but things are getting a little crazy at this point. Now, 3rd and 10 in the 25. We need a first down. Isaiah moves his way deep. Rodgers is going to throw it. It's double coverage, though. It's nearly intercepted. Isaiah didn't even jump. That's a poor effort on Isaiah's part. So we're forced to kick a field goal. We get another one later on. So at halftime, it's 7-6 to six for the Atlanta Falcons. Our offense has to do better. Our defense has been solid, but the offense is lacking. Now, a good pass here by Aaron Rodgers. Isaiah finds some room and gets across the 40 to the 42. Aaron Rodgers has 10 completions for only 93 yards. He has to do better. He needs to challenge the team deep downfield. Now, third and two with a uh, minute 30 left in the third quarter. Isaiah fights his way through the middle. He's going to break a couple of tackles, and he gets 90 rushing yards so far on the day. But we're still down 10 to 6. Now, Isaiah on the left-hand sideline is going to haul that one in. Gets three feet inbounds, and now we're nearing scoring territory. But going into the fourth quarter, the offense has been lackluster. We need to step up huge. We need Aaron Rodgers to come up big, and Isaiah has got to get this team on the scoreboard as well. Now going back to the halfback screen, look at the blocking. Three defenders are destroyed at the same time, and you guys know what it is. It would not be an Isaiah King touchdown without a ridiculous celebration. So it's a 13-13 ball game now. Isaiah's going to try to fight his way through. Almost gets the first down. He's a couple defenders on his back, but he is stopped short. Now third and two. Look at the blocking for here. Isaiah Isaiah's going to the edge. He's got one guy to beat in a foot race, but number 29 is going to make Isaiah stumble a little bit. He ends up getting brought down at 152 yards for the uh, ball game so far today. But how did Isaiah not go all the way to the end zone? That's a poor effort on his part. Now a great play here to Richard Rodgers by uh, Aaron Rodgers down to the one-yard line. Now Aaron Rodgers back in the pocket, plenty of time, throws it out to the right hand side, this one is going to be holding for a touchdown, a great play by Devontae Adams, gets a couple feet in bounds, what a route, almost ran out of room there, but he does get that last foot in to give us a 20-13 to lead. Now with 2.13 left, Isaiah finds a hole here, he's going to try to break a tackle, and look at Isaiah, grown man strength, he's going to go all the way to the end zone here, just shy of the 2 minute warning, a huge play from Isaiah, a ridiculous celebration. And that's going to give us a 27-13 lead. The Falcons just scored to make it 27-20. But ultimately, we're going to walk out of here with another W today. Matt Ryan played really, really well. Aaron Rodgers had 31 attempts. His completion percentage wasn't that great. But Isaiah with a ridiculous 236 yards on the ground thanks to that last run. So the season's going well. Isaiah's playing strong. Let's see if we can keep it going in the next episode. Thanks for watching today's video. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. Hit the like button to share your support. And I'll see you guys in the next one.